Wouldn't it be so funny if this first fish that I went for was a koala camp? I doubt it. It's going to be a sea bass. Ah. Sea bass. <sighs> well, hello there. Ooh. That's what I'm looking for. Blast from the past. I caught a koala can. Think positive. Be a koala can. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Just to update you guys a little bit on what went on yesterday since I did not put out a video. Basically, I just went ahead and got a bunch of stuff done. We got a new villager, which I'll introduce you guys to in a little bit. We also went and sold off pretty much everything from my last video. And then I went ahead and bought as many turnips as I could get for 96 bells a piece. Unfortunately, today, both prices were 52 bells and 46 bells. So, you know, not exactly the kind of price in return we're looking for. 36,800 bells. Yeah, that is awesome. Biff, what's going on, buddy? He's thinking about something. Yeah. Catch a squid for Biff. Of course, dude. Literally first try. Literally my first thing that I caught. That is perfect. Brought you something, Biff. You're welcome, dude. A trophy? What is this? A sweatshirt. Thanks. Thanks, Biff. Uh, I appreciate that. And here's our new villager's house. He has actually a really cool looking house. It's kind of like a log cabin vibe to it. I really like it. But uh, this is going to be O'Hare's house, who is not the villager I was looking for for my first day. I got to be honest, but dang, that's actually a really cool wallpaper and flooring setup. Okay, uh, so he's moving in today. Did some really th real thinking about what we talked about before. And you're right, I should totally live on this island with you and your friends. So I'm here, and I'm going to start living that island life right now. Yeah, so he's he's chilling. I, I really like this, actually. This is a very, very cool combination. So CJ's in town today. We might as well go ahead and catch a bunch of fish and sell them off to him. I think that's actually what we're going to be doing for most of today. That's probably going to be my goal, is just to get a decent amount of fish that cost a decent amount of bells and then sell them off for huge profit. Sea bass. <sighs> I think this is a sturgeon. Oh yeah, it is. Very nice, very nice. The last major project task for Project K. Need some more residents to get some word of mouth going about our island if we want a higher rating. Okay, sell some land. This is the spot, let's do it. Should be built tomorrow. Sweet. House number two. And number three. House on top of a cliff. Let's go. What if the person that buys this house doesn't have a ladder, though? That, that could be a problem, right? All right. Decided to go to a new island, mainly because I feel like we might be able to find new villagers on deserted islands now, since I've got a bunch of plots open. And I was right. All right. We got a new villager. Bam. You can only build so much muscle by gathering stuff. What would be really cool is if I could live near someone that inspires me to go big on bulking up. Your triceps are just astonishing. Uh, yeah. Come on. Bam. Join the island. Let's do it. Be rivals of Swoldum and best buds in buffness. It's going to be mega epic. Well said. Oh, man. All right, cool. So that's going to be one new villager. We've got three more spots to fill, so maybe we'll go to some more islands today. Hey, one is sold. Bam's new home. Let's go. All right, island number two of the day. Who's our second villager going to be? We do have four spots to fill, so we're going to be going to a few of these today. And villager number two is nowhere to be seen. There should be a villager right here, and there's not. This is weird. Yeah, I think this might be my least favorite island layout out of all of them that we've been to so far. 2,000 nook miles down the drain. Okay, so that's number one on your big time fish catching streak. Keep it up and go for three in a row. All right, let's do it. Ooh, this one's shaking big. Nice, another cola can. Dang, man. We're getting lucky today. Two big time fish. Let's go for three in a row. The one time, the one time in my entire time playing this game so far that I've actively wanted to see a sea bass 
and there are none to be found. Like, really? <laughs> it has legitimately been 15 minutes, guys. None. And this should be it. Sea bass, baby! Three in a row. Wait, number one? What are you talking about, number one? I didn't miss any fish. What do you mean, number one? I don't know why it reset. I didn't go for any other fish than that. Ooh. Nice, dude. Number three of the day. Okay. Oh, two colacanth in a row. What are the odds, dude? That's awesome. Okay, I think this is a sea bass. Yeah. All right, either way, that's number three. No resets, which means you just completed the challenge. Go tell CJ. Okay, CJ. So much for my C Sports challenge. Photo op. Way to wreck that C Sports challenge. What a haul. <laughs> oh, man. How much are you going to give me for all these, CJ? We got three colacanths and a red snapper and some sea bass. I mean, that's some good money, right? 75k. Uh, yeah, I think we're gonna take that. Okay, so I think that unlocks him for the day, right? So now I can go around and catch a bunch of fish if I want to, and then sell them all to him, which is a pretty solid opportunity if I don't say so myself. Okay, inventory number two, kind of garbage, but it'll still be over 11,000 bells. I mean, this is pretty solid, guys. I know it's nothing like going and selling the tarantulas to the salamander guy, but... I mean, this is still pretty, pretty good. Oh, what's this? <sighs> Another ore fish. Man, everything is just dollar signs at this point. Money rock time, let's go. It just, it never gets less satisfying, you know? Picking up that few thousand bells every single day for free, it's, it's always fun. And here is inventory number three. I think this is going to be a big one. 48,945 bells. Dude, this is just ridiculous. All right, guys. So I figured we might as well spend my last 2,000 nook miles and go on to another deserted island just to make sure... Well, this isn't exactly a cheery landscape where we're probably going to find a villager, but uh, to make sure there aren't any more villagers that uh, we can go ahead and find. But it doesn't look like that's going to be the case, unfortunately. Dang, it is really storming, isn't it? Another one. Oh. Ooh, that's what we need more of. Okay, nice. Love how the game is playing this nice tropical music and it's like full on hurricane season over here. Like, look at this sky. This music does not fit at all. Another one. Are you kidding me? I'll have you know, I clicked to that. I 100% didn't miss that fish, okay? I clicked the button, it just went away anyways, okay? Screw this, dude. I'm chopping down some bamboo trees. Let's go. I know this isn't the best inventory, but it does have some value and we got a bunch of resources, so I really can't complain too much. The lack of villager here is kind of a bummer. It means that I sort of wasted a bunch of miles, but you know, we had to check, right? I'm going to guess 16,000. Oh, 34,000. Uh, well, that'll work for me. <laughs> yeah, I spent a few hundred thousand on turnips, so that was pretty cool. So we're going to go ahead and sell those pretty soon, hopefully. And then on top of that, we have over 200,000 bells just normally that I just earned from today. So we're sitting in a really good position right now to be able to pay off some loans pretty soon. Oh, nice. That's got to be worth something. All right, CJ, final inventory of the day. We got a few good ones here. Football fish, some bear knife jaws. I mean, that's got to be worth some good cash, right? What do you got for me? 37,350. I mean, I, that's a pretty good way to send uh, send it off, you know? Uh, 240,000 even. I'm, I'm good with that. That's a lot of bells. I know, you know, a lot of you guys probably are playing the stock market. You bought a bunch of turnips and you're making bank right now. Probably have over a million bells. But, 
you know what? I'm just taking my time. I'm having a good time with it. And uh, this is a pretty solid haul from a day of fishing. So yeah. But yeah, guys, that's going to be about it for this one. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you guys have a fantastic day. And I'll see you back here for the next one very, very soon. Until then, peace.